tabs. This is the reinforced part. You can see the thickness of the metal up here. This is about the normal thickness. This is the thickness that we made right here. And it's all reinforced with chrome alloy, 4130. Uh, I think it's a quarter inch uh, chrome alloy, uh, quarter inch thickness. And then we made plates here for adjustment from the sliders. And it's all on both sides and on the front side as well. So 2011 Raptor, we got different suspension than the factory, uh, reinforced spindles, uh, upper camber A-arm, um, tie rods, uh, we've reinforced the frame on the back part here with uh, a uh, longer bolt and reinforced 12.9 bolts and then longer on the reinforced the frame here or the lower control arm uh, points on both sides all the way around. Uh, custom mounted uh, Fox uh, reservoirs. Then further up the air, uh, a compressor output uh, over here. We have a transmission cooler. On top the heat exchanger for the custom supercharger application. Um, power steering cooler. Uh, we have a aftermarket Howie uh, power steering setup. We have Fox 3.0 coilovers here, reinforced um, chassis subframe up here. I don't know if you take a picture of it or a video of it. All custom uh, rear uh, leaf springs, Devers. Uh, we have a uh, Fox can uh, hydraulic bump stops up here. Custom Borla exhaust with uh, stainless works headers. Custom transmission. Little heat pan. All wrapped. So we have a uh, heat exchanger, and then you could probably see the transmission cooler now underneath here better. And this, then you have a custom brackets that are two, all reinforced at six on into six points or connected into six different points of, on into the uh, into factory mounting points on the car. Um, extra heat exchanger tank. This is the Howie steering that we were talking about earlier. Carbon fiber intake, custom made. Um, Whipple supercharger. These are four inch core heat exchanger and four inch core transmission coolers. Um, it's, it keeps super cool. And our transmission temps are around 200 normally and they go up, up to about 220, 230 off road at the highest point normally. That's about as far as we go. It's putting out over 700 horsepower to the wheels. And we're getting close to over 20 miles per gallon on the freeway, 15 through the city, 15, 16 through the city, and about 10 off-road.